think the Academy definitely, um, to all of you amazing lawmakers, to my Texas chapter, woohoo! Y'all rock? Of course, the DC chapter rocks too. Yeah. But uh, <laughs> this is surreal because I'm here most of the time honoring other people. And it feels kind of weird being honored, but it feels so good to be honored. And then it feels scary to be honored because now I got to do more. <laughs> but it's okay because I love doing more. I think that we, as creators, we know what it's like to birth something out of our experiences. And the one thing that I do know is that every person on earth, no matter what side of the aisle they are, no matter what color, creed, ethnicity, everyone has a heart. And if we are able to touch hearts, which is what we get a chance to do here at the Academy and as creators, I think that that's part of our responsibility. The other part of our responsibility is to make sure that young people who are just crawling around their mom's uh, bedrooms and playing tag in, in the park and stuff, once they realize how amazing they are and how creative they are, we stand for them right now. So by 2030, 2040, they'll look back and say, you know, those old people did a whole lot of stuff for us. Thank you for those who caught the joke. Those of you who didn't, there's some more red wine for you. <laughs> but uh, again, to everyone in this room, to Dr. Sheila Jackson Lee, thank you for being such an amazing supporter of mine for the longest. She knew me, Congresswoman knew me when I was a teenager singing in the choir. And she would always say, you did a good job, keep going. And it's people like her and all of you in this room who make what we do at the Recording Academy so well worth it. Yeah. And we just appreciate you. And God bless you. That's what we say. God bless you.